So the type of gear that you need for an NRL Hunter, NRL Hunter match really varies. Um, you know, some people bring a bunch of gear. I, this match I'm trying to go very minimalist. Um, I would say the big things that everybody has to have is a tripod and a good set of binos um, that, and then some way to calculate your dope with the uh, range finder. So you need to have a set of binos, a range finder, and a way to calculate dope along with a tripod is probably the basics. And then obviously support bags and um, any other type of gear really can help. So binos, again, uh, you need binos for these types of matches, so that way you have to find your targets first um, and having a good set of binos so you can quickly and easily scan the area, which is a skill in itself um, that I'm still trying to figure out, uh, you know, the proper way to scan and be able to locate targets. Uh, the good shooters can do that really methodically and, and get it done in a hurry. So binos are a, a key piece of, as far as target location and identification. So a range finder, once you find the target, uh, you need to figure out how far it is so you can dial your dope correctly. Um, and yeah, I have that built into my set of binos. So I'm trying to, you know, again, pare down how much I have. So my binos range and they also calculate my, my dial. So they, they calculate my dope. So as soon as I, I lays the target, it tells me exactly what I need to dial. So that last stage was 3.4 mils. Um, so it's just a quick way. Again, it's all on the clock, so I, I want to find a way to do this in a hurry. Um, and so, yeah, so you also need to have a way to calculate your dope. So either a, you can do it with a smartphone, with a Kestrel, set of binos. There's a bunch of different ways. Some people just do hard dope where it's written down on a card, and, and uh, you know, that's another way to do it. You really should have a tripod, a good tripod, so you can... There's sometimes where you're using it as a shooting tool. I always use it to lay the distances to the targets, so that way you get those good distances and uh, really have confidence in that dope. So some things that I really bring with me that aren't necessarily needed, but a huge help. So a support bag, I bring just my one tricorn bag with me. Um, again, I try to bring what I bring in the field hunting and this is light enough that I bring that with. Uh, I also bring, I would say, a, a good bino harness or something that you can keep your binoculars close and, and safe. Um, otherwise you end up dropping them, losing them. They get rolling off to the side. So having a way to keep them nice and secure uh, is important. And then I've got a little tiny tool kit in my bag that, you know what, I'm always, you know, something goes down, something breaks. Uh, it's an easy way to fix on stuff.